This is Dirty Newbie with Conspiracy Concepts. Today's episode is Christian Identity, Angloism versus Germanicism in the Anglo Collusion with the Government. This is Christian Identity, 1940s through 1970s. Uh, we're going to start a little bit early with William Dudley Paley, the Silver Shirt, and the Dyes Committee. Then we're going to move on to William Potter Gale, Wesley Swift, and Gerald K. Smith. William Dudley Peely, born March 12, 1890, died June 30, 1965. He wrote for the Chicago Tribune. He joined the Red Cross in Siberia and helped white Russians against communism. Wrote two Hollywood films in the 1920s. The Light in the Dark and the Shock uh, created the Silver Legion in 1933. He ran for president in 1936 for the Christian Party. Uh, ultimately went to prison for claiming the damage at Pearl Harbor was worse than the government claimed. Served eight years. The Silver Shirts. Founded January 31st, 1933, dissolved 1941. It was a nationalist, fascist, and Christian paramilitary group. Called for a Christian Commonwealth. Membership declined after 1936 failed uh, election campaign run. Peely was in prison for violating probation of a 1935 securities violation. In North, Carolina, in North Carolina. After being on probation for the same charge, the court put him back in prison because of what he published uh, about Pearl Harbor. And this speculation, his campaign run got him his security charge to eliminate him from the campaign run and his media organization was Ruined by the Un-American House Committee, ran by Representative Martin Dyes, Democrat, to ensure American conservative cooperation in World War II. Peely's organization was Germanicist, and the Germans faced further subjugation from the Anglo-establishment. Um, yeah, they faced the, the bad World War II narrative uh, upcoming post-Swift years as well. Dyes Committee was 1938 to 1944. They were a special investigative committee. They were the Un-American Activities Committee, House of America, or um, created by the House of Representatives, formed uh, from two previous government organizations. Purpose was to investigate treason, with the main targets being Germans and Russians, communists and Nazis. Also put together an argument supporting Japanese internment camps called the Yellow Report. The KKK was in mostly good standing with the community because of the Anglo alignment. There were many overlapping members of both, both Anglo and Germanicist groups. In America, many people have the racial mixture. So, part of the culture war is to get the race mixed group to go with the, Ang the Anglo alignment, the Anglo, Anglo law. So, that's why uh, that's why groups that were ultra Angloist like the KKK were covered uh, during this uh, sweep by the government. William Potter Gale was born 1916, died 1988. Father was raised as Jewish but re rejected the religion. His father came to America fleeing anti-Semitism in Russia, 1894. Enlisted in, he and William Potter Gale enlisted in the military at 16 
and claimed he was Hebrew. He's known for uh, running the group Posse Comitatus, which was inherited from a German, uh, from a, mem a former member of the Silver Shirts. Uh, he also ran the Christian Defense League and the California Rangers. He consolidated organizations through his leadership. He served in the Philippines as an officer under Douglas MacArthur. He's closely connected to Wesley Swift, who is directly of the Rand line of Christian identity after 1956 through the Church of Jesus Christ Christian. He had a failed House of Representative campaign run in California. He is the youngest military officer gaining of the time period, gaining rank of Lieutenant Colonel in 1946. Wesley Swift was born September 9th or September 6th, 1913. He died October 8th, 1970. He was taught by Philip Monson. He is of the Rand Tottenheim British Israelite lineage, the uh, thought lineage. He uh, helped manage the California Rangers in the Christian Defense League. He was closely connected to Gerald K. Smith, who was a Nazi sympathizer politician in the 1940s. He helped manage William Potter Gale's organization. He had a successful radio show, and his lifetime occupation was uh, a Christian minister. Now we're gonna move on to Gerald K. Smith. He was born February 27th, 1898 died April 15th 1975 he took over share he took over the share our wealth movement after lieutenant government governor Huey Long was assassinated he was a member of a silver of the silver shirts and then Swift's uh, Church of the Jesus Christ Christian Church there's an overlapping member. He was an overlapping member of Germanicist and Anglo groups. Like a German would, he formed a union party. Like a Germanicist would, he formed a union party with the radio priest, Father Coughlin. Anglo groups would have never worked with a Catholic. He was targeted for sedition by the government during World War II. Uh, he beat the charge. Meet Swift 19, in 1947, uh, three years after the after the trial. He used Swift as a, for bodyguard services and chauffeur chauffeur services. He made Swift the representative of the Christian Nationalist Crusade, and Gerald K. Smith built white Jesus a white Jesus statue in Arkansas that was inspired by. A German passion play held yearly in Germany. So this is what I had this week. Next episode we're going to cover Richard Butler and the Order. Uh, this week I just mainly wanted to accentuate the divide between the Germanicist and the Angloist group groups and that British Israelite Brit British Israelism and Christian identity. Um, were formed to uh, make the distinction and to uh, further uh, further the proxy war against the uh, against the the Catholics because the Angloists are extreme Protestants and the Germans uh, can go either way Protestant or Catholic and so do the Hispanics and that's a, a topic for another episode but the the Texas uh, Revolutionary War which is a war against uh, Anglos versus the Spanish but anyway thank you for watching and uh, bye